Step out of the shadows okay. and be Bruce Wayne uh, tonight. Bruce, you're the Batman oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Now, guys, this guy's a rich person. Oh, hota hai. Bahut zyada meet hota hai. But apni rich life ko guys utna successful nahi karta. Time to save the city. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, Bruce Wayne and the big parties. Party. Okay. कैसे कैसे आते गए हमारा क्या फर्स्ट चैप्टर खत्म होता है वेलकम टू गौथम ओके खत्म होता है क्या हमारा फर्स्ट एपिसोड थैंक यू थैंक यू एवरीवन A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Okay. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Ye kon hai? For too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed mm, under point. Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. Okay. तो गाइस ये बंदा बोला कि वो आपको देखा गा पे मूवी देखे तो गौतम सेट्टी में ओनली मिस्टर वेन माय कैंपेन्स लार्जेस्ट बैकर कुड हैव हर्ड दैट अपॉज ही वुड अच्छा काम किसी ओह देयर ही इज फैशनेबल एंड फैशनेबली लेट एज ऑलवेज से हाय ब्रूस हाय ब्रूस हाय ब्रूस वेल आई टी एम अप एंड ही नॉक्स हिम डाउन दैट्स हाउ मिस्टर वेन एंड आई डू बिजनेस Thank you. Thank you again everyone for your unwavering support. Okay. Together. We will change God. Sab kuch game bhi bajana padega. Ye hamare plan mein bhi sakta hai. Thank you for opening your house to us. Now I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. अरे यार मैं लेट हो गया ओके वो लेट होने वाले came here tonight to see me you want to see the bruce way no no right then i can see him just fine from here this shouldn't be painful it's not a kidney stone it's only a little face time with potential donors mm. your face specifically with a mouth that's saying support harvey dent okay where the grease there the wheels and they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make gotham okay. a place for families again I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now I need a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. Which, for the record, I have not been since before law school. All right, all right, all right. How about uh, a new face for Gotham? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm going to use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime where children can play in the Why streets again. That's what I want to do, but that. you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. Dusro. Bruce Wayne ka ghar hai. ये कौन आ रहा है गाड़ी से गाड़ी? मतलब उसके घर को है पार्टी के लिए यूज कर रहे हैं। वो ये उसकी दोस्त है। पॉथोल ऑन मेन स्ट्रीट But I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. Okay. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. Huh. I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know, like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbox are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. 
Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, it seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's okay. a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent is our best shot. Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes and that grin will win him over. He's gonna need more than that, yeah, son. Like that. Oh, it hasn't been 15 minutes yet, Bob. We've still got time. Uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, okay. oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some but alleyway, guys, but it was terrible. Didn't they a guy Truly terrible. terrible. Yeah, a tragedy and like that, that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right Thanks treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think but about maybes. Don't bold, and I'm sure you don't either. My family uh, well, family. thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. I'm not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Not interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. I don't know. Actually, I do mind. If you're not on the list, you're not here. Sorry. <sighs> we'll talk tomorrow, then. Okay. Mr. Wayne, you've... you've got something on your collar. Um... <laughs> Is that blood? Yeah. It looks like... Maybe it does. Uh, actually, it's, uh... It's lipstick. Well, well, no wonder you were late. Say no more. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but, uh, Another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. You gonna go? Carmine Falcone? Carmine Falcone. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything, <laughs> except being a businessman who guys, loves this city. Story, Excuse us, Miss Vale. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham, for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Okay, I don't want him here. I don't want him in my home. Bruce Actually, Bruce you Bruce don't want him Bruce angry. Bruce. Trust me. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. Okay. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. <laughs> Man, Let's all talk flash, privately. no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? Hey, <laughs> I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Carmine Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. You're a respectable man, I hear. Bruce Wayne. Gentleman, I know who you are. The guy is gonna sell me his house. 
Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlour. Follow me, if you will. Yeah, good guys, Garma Garmi, what are you guys? Okay. You should know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill has... Hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce? You'll be fine out Harvey there, comes Harvey. with me. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey, Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. <laughs> Seen <laughs> and not <laughs> heard. <laughs> Whatever you... Ah, what did I say? Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say any will. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So are you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move, and I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. Sure. That's why I came here tonight to your Black lovely home, to hoping to he make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Look, I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked, trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know, somewhere inside that tuxedo, you understand this situation. Money gets money. Okay. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's going to get what's coming to him. Okay. Is episode which last scenes? It's me. It's me. It's me. 
Dragoi.